Hey, what's up y'all from the shop? So it's been a little bit since I made a video for you guys. So uh, I figured I needed to catch up on what all we've been doing here in the shop, finishing the floors, getting stuff reorganized. And as you can see, um, I got my 07 Escalade in here and we are getting ready to actually turn this into a big project. So um, how I'm gonna do this video series, I'm not 100% sure but we're going to be pulling the L92, the 6.2 liter, that's in this truck, the 6L80 transmission, and we're gonna rebuild the whole thing. Now this is our family SUV, so it's the daily driver, but I'm a hot rodder, so I got some cool stuff we're gonna do, and uh, everybody's gonna know when we pull up to get gas that uh, the old Escalade's got a little something. So I'm pretty excited to do the build. I've been waiting years. Uh, for it to give me the excuse to finally, I guess, poop out on me. And uh, it's got that variable valve timing. It's been throwing codes and um, low compression. It's got 270,000 miles on it. It's tired. So between that, leaking oil, um, the transmission, we flushed it here a couple months ago just trying to prolong it. And uh, the pump makes a bunch of funny sounds now. So... Um, if you're going to do one, you might as well do both, so we're getting ready to yank all of it. So, let me show you guys a little bit of what we got in the shop in preparation for this project. Let's get your turn. What have we got? So, we got the Escalade in here, and you can see our pretty epoxy floors. Got those all finished up. Got all of our boxes and stuff ready to rock and roll. And the other side of the shop with the 68 Barracuda project. So we got our engine stand ready. We got our engine hoist ready. We're going to end up pulling, and I may do a video of this, but we're gonna pull this whole front end off and we're gonna pull that whole drivetrain straight out the front. And in preparation over here, got our trash, we got our parts cleaner, we got our parts table that we'll end up putting bags and stuff on uh, to label our parts and then another table with our transmission jack ready to rock and roll and a regular jack and a creeper because, well, I'm getting older and I don't want to just slide around on my back. And eventually, we got this lift over here too. We got to install this thing. We got all these parts, that's a whole nother project. Oh, and this little thing right, uh, right there, 100 bucks. Hyper Tough, whatever, Walmart brand, uh, pressure washer. And um, that was really step one of this project because living out in the country, everything's freaking covered in mud. So I paid 100 bucks for that thing. It's a little electric pressure washer. I've always had gas powered ones. That thing's freaking handy. It's actually pretty cool. For 100 bucks, I would say, yeah, if you don't got one, go grab one. I pressure wash the whole underneath side of this truck. Um, to get the mud and basic grease off. And then obviously once we start actually yanking the drivetrain, um, we'll degrease and uh, use that pressure washer to clean up everything and make it look new. So I'm probably gonna figure out how to do a time-lapse video here uh, so we can kind of speed through because you sure don't wanna watch me for hours and hours undo every part or I may just do merged videos. Um, but this is our next project. So we're getting ready to yank this motor. I'm gonna get started today. And uh, then all the fun stuff comes after that. So stick around, see you guys.